Hey, and welcome to day two of the Mum Got Strong Challenge. Now, well done for getting through day one and getting to your reality, working out where it is that you are, what the facts are around your body, around your habits, around your lifestyle, because without doing that, it's going to be really, really difficult to move forward. Now, day two is really exciting because I love food, okay? And for a very long time, I had this crappy negative relationship with food, yeah? So I had done all of the things. I had done... I don't know. I, I probably cannot count them on two hands. I'd done soup diets. I'd done, I'd quit sugar. I'd done paleo. I'd done keto. I'd done OptiFast. I'd done a liver cleansing diet. It was just ridiculous. All these things I was trying and yet I could not see long-term results. So yeah, like I might've lost a little bit of weight, felt crappy. My mood was horrible. I was irritable because I was starving, obviously. But I just thought I had to do these really restrictive and really obsessive things to be able to create this strong looking tone body. But really, my body was not healthy because I was starving it. I was not fueling it. Okay, so that's one thing that we need to do. Okay, so we need to actually do two things that we need to rebuild two things. Okay. And firstly, we need to rebuild our relationship around food. Okay. Because we need to see food as fuel. Okay. Food is great and we can eat lots of good food. We have this idea that we have to eat less and we have to cut out carbs or we have to cut out calories or we can't eat these certain food groups, things like dairy or sugar or, you know, uh, fruit. So we have all of these negative connotations around food but it's this relationship that we actually need to rebuild, okay? So that's the first thing. Secondly, we need to rebuild our metabolism because all of these things that you've been trying in the past have actually been doing more damage than good. It's actually been damaging your metabolism, down-regulating your metabolism, so your body is not functioning properly and how it should be, so it's making it even harder for you to lose weight, okay? So that's why you get to these things and you might try them, you might lose a little bit of weight, but then you'll plateau, okay? And then you'll stop and then you'll put the weight back on. It's because your body is not getting the fuel that it needs from food, okay? So food, you know, it has lots of macronutrients, lots of micronutrients to do all of these different functions that our body needs to do, okay? And if you're not fueling it, if you're only having shakes or if you're cutting out one whole macronutrient like your carbs, then of course your body's not going to function properly, okay? You're going to have really low energy. You're going to be irritable because basically you're not, your brain isn't getting enough fuel. Your brain can't function properly. So that's why you're feeling frustrated. You're feeling irritable. You're feeling moody. You're feeling lethargic. So we need to fix this. We need to rebuild this, okay? So I discovered after this big long journey of going through all of these crappy things that just made me feel like rubbish, a way that you can actually sustain good food. You can eat food, you can eat carbs, you can eat lots of it, and you can do it in a way that's actually enjoyable, okay? And this comes down to relearning and re-educating because what I see happening is all of these quick fixes, the shakes and the pills and the diets, they're just band-aids for the actual core problem, okay? We're not getting to fix that core problem, which is, education because for so long we've been brainwashed into thinking that um you know we have to do these quick fixes but in order to see something that's lifelong and sustainable and to create this toned body that looks healthy and is healthy and is fit and defined you need to actually re-educate yourself around nutrition and to me that's actually fixing the core problem okay so until you do that you're always going to be jumping from one thing to the next maybe seeing results for short term, but never been able to sustain it, yeah? So what is going to happen is within this five-day program, I'm going to give you a little bit of a taste of what we do in our full VIP program within Fit Vibes, because obviously that education takes time, right? So it's not something that you'll just get straight away. Whereas when you pick a shake or you pick a pill, it's like a quick fix, you get it straight away. But to be able to really solve your problem long term, it's going to take a little bit longer than that, okay? So, but until you do that, you are forever going to stay stuck. And not only that, like if your kids see you um, having this really unhealthy relationship with food, what is that actually saying to them? Like they're only going to pick up on the habits that you are actually doing. So if you don't fix this and address this yourself, they're going to have this unhealthy relationship 
good food for the rest of their lives as well. And I know that that's something that I did not want to have my boys have to go through. Okay. So the fact that I'm now educated, I can then teach that to them and pass those good habits on to them. Okay. So without rebuilding your metabolism and without rebuilding your relationship with food, you are going to stay stuck. It is as simple as that. Okay. And you don't have to be restricted. You don't have to be deprived. You don't have to give up your social life. You don't have to take your Tupperware containers to the barbecue with you like I once did because that was just ridiculous, okay? Because now I know about food. I know what options to choose. I know how to have food that I love and enjoy, foods that I used to cut out like potato and fruit and dairy and um, what else do I eat? Like so many different things, a little bit of sugar, you know, like dates and I make, you know, homemade ice cream and all of these delicious things that my kids enjoy as well and I can do that. I can feel good. I have so much energy. My brain functions properly. I'm not irritable and snapping at my husband and my kids anymore because I just feel good. My body is healthy and I can sustain this lean, strong tone body all year round and it doesn't take much work. Okay. So right now you're probably in this cycle where, you know, you restrict yourself. And then you get sick of that and you crave sugar, you crave carbs, so then you binge, okay? And then you feel really guilty and then you restrict yourself again. And this cycle just goes on and on, okay? So until you start to rebuild these the two things that we spoke about, you're going to stay stuck. Okay, so what I want you to do is I want you to click on the link below, download your day to activity tasks, go through them and really realize that in order to get out of this trap, to be able to be free from all of this food obsession and all of this you know, rubbish that we do and spend so much money on, it's really about coming back to basics and educating yourself, okay? So I will see you in day three.